Welcome to ShakeUp Tech. So I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can unlock your bootloader of the Moto G5, Moto G 5G, or the Motorola One 5G S, and install the Lineage OS 18.1, which is based on Android 11. Inst install this 15-second uh, ADB installer. So you have your in ADB interface. After installing, you will see this ADB folder in your C drive. Also, as a safety measure, install this driver from uh, Motorola so the fastboot commands will work and your device will show up when you type in fastboot devices in the terminal. So, in this folder of ADB, you have to uh, press Shift and right click and open the Windows terminal. We are going to type every command in this terminal. So keep it open. Now we need to unlock the bootloader. Go to the Motorola bootloader site. I have already unlocked the bootloader of my device. You can go ahead and follow these steps. Sign in with your Google account. So go to your ADV folder and make sure your, your device is connected and open the terminal and type in here ADB reboot bootloader and after you hit enter your device will boot into the bootloader mode. So copy this command and paste it in the terminal. And after you, if you hit enter, you will get this data. You have to make sure to remove all the bootloader the, and the spaces, and only the numbers should remain. And the numbers and this side, this right side, and then you have to put this uh, together and paste it here. Mines look like this. Make sure there are no spaces. And after you hit this, can my device be unlocked? You will receive unlock key through email and you will get the unlock key on your email. Copy that code and then again go to the terminal. And this time you have to you have to type unlock and then just paste your code here and after you hit enter your device uh, will boot into a new screen it will ask you if you want to go uh, along with the unlocking and you have to use the power button to select so press volume down and then press the power button to confirm and now your bootloader is unlocked again go to the terminal and this time we will type fast boot boot twrp dot img before that make sure you have copied the recovery file in the adb folder and also rename it to tw twrp so after you hit enter your phone will boot into the twrp recovery but it is not permanent because we have only booted into it and not flashed it in the recovery option make sure you are in slot a it will show your current slot Now we need to backup our data. So backup the EFSN persist. You can use a USB OTG to backup to the pen drive or if you have a macro SD card, use that and keep the backup in a safe place. Now we are going to 
flash the uh, the partition zip so using the same USB driver SD card locate it and flash it it is going to take a bit of a time now we will flash the lineage os rom so locate the file make sure you are in uh, slot a and then just flash the file Once the flashing is complete, reboot in the bootloader. After you have flashed the Lineage OS ROM, again go to the terminal and from here again run this command TWRP boot into the TWRP uh, recovery and then you can go ahead and flash the G apps and the Magisk. Now we can go ahead and flash our G apps. So again locate your file and make sure it is the Android 11 one and flash the G apps. Now after flashing the G apps and the Magisk, again go to the terminal and this time type fastboot hyphen and w and after you run this command your data your user data and cache will be wiped and after this process just press start uh, press the power button on your phone and it will boot into the lineage os. So I last used the Lineage OS in my Moto G5 Plus. So it feels good using it again. So after using this ROM for a while, I will be coming up with a full review. And also I found out how to pass the safety net. So I will mention that step as well. So stay tuned for that and hit the like button and subscribe to my channel to get more updates about the future custom ROMs and development for Moto G 5G and Motorola One 5G S. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.